Hi guys, it is a spectacularly gorgeous summer night in early March. It is a Monday night, March 7th, 2022, so I am hanging out in the uh, suicide cave of a, uh, of a toxic bitch. Uh, only Sancho Panza still enjoying the couch to this night. He loves the couch where that woman blew her brain out. Uh, but speaking of mentally ill women, uh, <laughs> speaking of mentally ill women, guys, you knew it was going to have to happen. You knew what I when, when I said that I was never going to do another Dulcinea video again as long as I live. Well, I don't know. It's, is it because of the uh, the margarita and, and Dulcinea's amazing woman cup that I'm drinking out of, or maybe it is the uh, it is the clonopin is the reason uh, in my brain between the clonopin and the tequila. I have decided to spend this beautiful evening where I could be sitting watching the the crescent moon and Orion and listening to the gators and stuff. I choose to be sitting here alone in the uh, the end of the road in the Point Lonesome Swap checking in with Dulcinea to see what uh, to see what my heart throb is up to uh, here in March of 2022 and I guess we find Dulcinea in the bathtub. This is uh, Dulcinea in the bathtub. I don't, I don't know how she keeps, this is a three-part video. Her videos are very short. So this is part one of a three-part uh, bath fun in the tub with Dulcinea video titled Dear Hambone Big FD. You can uh, figure out for yourself what FD means. But let's uh, join Dulcinea in the bathtub. Take it away, darling. Hey, Hambone, here's the deal. You were right about the UFOs and the alien thing. Um, you're right about the planet, all of it. They're fucking dicks. They're going to fucking leave us here and everybody else. They're all about themselves. We're fucking fucked. You're right. We're fucked. Now come get me so I can show you my 70s bush and we can, like, get on with it, you know, till we die in the collapse. I love you. All right, show me her 70s bush. I, uh, as far as I know, Dulcinea was born in 1971. I'm not sure what the 70s bush she is referring to. I can only imagine uh, that invitation. Okay, but let's check in uh, later on in the bathtub. That was chapter one. Here is chapter two titled... I will resist. Let's see if Dulcinea is resisting thinking about Hambone. I can resist you, you fucking dick. Okay, let's, uh, I need to go have another swallow of uh, clonopin laced uh, tequila from my amazing woman cup. And we're going to finish up with Help Horny, Help Horny to round out Dulcinea's bath time. What a fucking dick. He's got me so fucking horny. He's a fucking cunt. 
I will destroy you. Just one. Okay, well, darling, I think you've already destroyed me. Uh, I have never taken a bath with Dulcinea. But anyway, let's, uh, this is Dulcinea playing my videos on her channel. So Turnabout's Fair Play. This is titled, You Are a Miracle and Everything About You Can Be Seen as a Gift. Take it away, Dulcinea. Them to stop thinking about their depression. It gets your mind off your pointless, uh, useless, yawn. teeny weeny little. I, I was I was saying life there, not dick. By the way. The name of this video is "A Bipolar Fool Faces His Manic Madness." That was the name of my video, not the name of the video you're listening to. Hambone, hey, your mental illness, your quote-unquote mental illness is your gift. We were wrong. I'm a social worker, okay? I take full responsibility. We were wrong. It's nuanced, okay? It's also a gift. <sighs> Love, peace, free. It's nuanced. There you go. I you know, it, it, it's great to be in love with a, a woman who, she's not exactly the same mental illness. My comment to that video was obviously, darling, you are my manic mental illness, but this damn destruction project keeps my mind off you for a few hours per day. But I don't want you to think that uh, that hambone little tail is the only man on uh, <clears throat> Dulcinea's brain. Dulcinea is also fixated on Elon Musk. She is apparently uh, conflicted on Elon, so this is her latest. She has probably more videos to Elon Musk even than to have my little tail. This is her latest. Dear Elon Musk. Okay. Hey, Inky. Hey, Enlil. It's Hawthor! And if I don't fucking get you this lifetime, I'll get you next lifetime. So look out, motherfucker, because I got demons ready to fucking eat your heart out, you fucking cunt! Okay. Now, one more. Now, I, I really don't know uh, whether this one is for me or for Elon or just for the general public. This one is called Poke Through. Poke Through. See how tight it is? So if I wear it without a bra, my nipples will poke through. Uh, yeah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, God. Guys, four billion women on this planet. Four billion women on this planet. And uh, this is the one that the universe has sent to torture me. Uh, what the fuck? You, you know, I'm, I'm really sitting here. Uh, I need to go eat that San Pedro cactus. It would be nice if uh, Dulcinea were here with me. Uh, I would love to do uh, San, which is peyote. Uh, I noticed that Dulcinea is in the market for some mushrooms. I had some mushrooms that I got for her uh, that we were going to do mushrooms together uh, in New York last summer. As far as I know, they're still sitting in the fucking refrigerator 
in New York, uh, I really need to uh, go out there and cash in this Klonopin and uh, do some goddamn mescaline. I have uh, decided uh, the full moon, I am going to eat this San Pedro cactus out here in the Point Lonesome Swamp. So, uh, Dulcinea, uh, if you want to come do some mescaline with Hambone uh, in the full moon, this is your invitation. I can imagine uh, what that would look like. Last time I did San Pedro Cactus with a woman, I think it was the best sex I ever had in my life. I honestly believe it was the best sex I ever had in my life. It was the New Year's Eve between, uh, between uh, 2009 and 2010 in this little border town in Ecuador on the border between Ecuador and Peru. I've told part of that story and uh, I really wish I could remember what happened uh, when Doris and I uh, <laughs> anyway uh, okay Dulcinea come get me in the San Pedro cactus And we will see what we can stir up in the Point Lonesome Swamp. To bid farewell, four weeks from today, uh, four weeks from tomorrow morning, I will be pulling out of the Point Lonesome Swamp. Heading to New York, baby! If I don't die of a fucking hernia first. I gotta head over to Netflix and get away from this crazy woman. Jesus. I think I'm gonna go watch The Exorcist. Maybe. I think I need an exorcist. What do you guys think? Does anyone know where I can find an exorcist? Please send one to the Point Lonesome Swamp. I have a demon. Or what was it? What did she say? How many demons that I need to exorcise from my psyche? The amazing woman. Yep, darling, you are an amazing woman. No denying that. Bye, guys. Bye, darling.